Hello students, once again very good morning to you all. Hope all of you are keeping fine in this fine morning. Once again, I sincerely welcome you all to our English literature class. See, yesterday I had completed story number 8 that was of singing lesson written by Catherine Mansfield. Catherine Mansfield, I had completed that story. Right now, I am going to summarize the total thing for you. Uh, after summarizing the total thing, uh, in 10 to 15 minutes time, I will be broadcasting uh, the content, central uh, things of this particular short story and you will be able to understand it better. So once again, I sincerely welcome you all to the class of singing lesson. Uh, please pay attention. This particular short story, singing lesson, is written by Catherine Mansfield. To speak about this particular author, the singing lesson is one of Catherine Mansfield's stories included in the Garden Party and other stories. Thus, this particular story is uh, from the story collection of the book called The Garden Party and other stories. So, from there it is taken. Alright. And the what the story is telling us, perhaps the theme like that, the story explores the theme of despair, sadness, reliance, appearance, desperation and happiness. These are the themes that we are going to say. What our Catherine Maxfield is projecting, she is projecting these ideas to this short story. Now, the summary as the summary of this short story can be uh, divided into seven, eight points, seven to eight points. Those seven, eight points I am going to tell you. Point number one, on the way to the classroom, on the way to the classroom, who miss meadows. Her way to the classroom. Which classroom? Singing classroom. And point number two. As she goes ahead, meeting with the science mistress, Miss Meadows meets with science mistress, another uh, teacher of this particular school. So please remember. Then the third point, sense of anguish and anger. The third point, the sense of anguish and anger, disappointment, worry, tension and at the same time anger. Why she is so anger? Because she has been abandoned by her fiancé, Mr. Basil. All the tensions of her heart is inside and her total behavior is based on this one. Then, the sad song, next point of the summary is that sad song. As she had planned, she had the plan of teaching the students about a happy romantic song. Now, when she reaches the music hall, she asked the students to turn page number 14, which contained a lemon song. A lemon song means sad song. And this sad song, she asked her students to sing without much expression. Then, next point that we have to focus is song. This particular song reflects the uh, this particular song reflects Miss Meadow's mood. The trouble which she was undergoing, that reflects
collector in this lament song. Then the next point is that her thoughts about her fiancé, Mr. Basil, how he had appeared, what conversation uh, they had, all those things. Thus, Miss Meadows thinks about Mr. Basil. Now, the next thing is the turning point. The turning point of the story is that a little girl called Margaret, Margaret, she comes and then passes the message to Miss Meadows that Miss Yacht wants to meet Miss Meadows in her office. Miss Yacht, she is the principal of the school. Thus, Miss Meadows meeting with the headmistress. Who is the headmistress? Miss Yacht. Then, next point, the headmistress re-implement Mr. So, uh, the headmistress, Miss Yacht, re uh, Last hour of the class, last 
few minutes of the class. Her sadness will not like that way, and of course she did uh, get uh, enjoyment. Then, what is the message that we get? What is the message that we get? I think the message that we get is that we need to be ready to face any challenges that comes in our world. We do not know what are the situations that we are going to face every now and then. But at the same time, we need to face the challenges which comes to our life. We cannot be escapists. Here, Miss Meadows, she was not ready to accept the reality of her life, but finally, and as a result, she uh, made her singing class a horrible class. Now, moving ahead, uh, let us talk something about the title of the story. This title of the story is very appropriate, even if you don't like it, you have to appreciate the things because ultimately we all try to get the best possible mark in our examination. So, it is very much appropriate and suggestive. Uh, it, the writer, through this one, the writer conveys the inner turmoil in Miss Meadow's mind at first and later the happy state of her mind. Two sides of the mind that is reflected. The inner struggle, then happiness. Yes. Then, the song, the sad song, Lament is sung by the girls in a way that brings out the feelings of despair, helplessness and happiness. Why Miss Meadows asked her students to sing the lament song, sad song? Because she wanted to reflect or tell what trouble she is facing. She wanted to sing. So that is the thing. Thus, the theme is very much appropriate singing lesson because the entire thing happens in the class, singing class. Students sing, she reflects on the letter. So, in this particular story, both the letter, the first letter and the telegram, cut of telegram, these things you have to be very careful, focus on those things, then automatically you will be able to write the answers. Then I would like to tell the main protagonist uh, of the play, of course, the characters. Uh, Miss Meadows is the main protagonist, central figure protagonist of the story, that is Miss Meadows. She is very, very popular music teacher, very sensitive, sentimental and introverted appearance valuable to her. So, then, Miss Dusty character, that is Mr. Basil, though he doesn't come as a figure, we come to know about him through the letter. So, he is the second character. Then, apart from that, some other smiling characters are also there, like a science mistress, Miss Meadows had a small encounter with the science mistress, then Mary Basley, who played the accompaniment. Second accompaniment means the instruments or the keyboard. Then, of course, um, other singing group. Then, uh, we cannot just, we cannot simply forget uh, the principal or the headmistress of the school, Miss Yacht. So, we cannot forget this are the, they are the characters of this song. And finally, the critical appreciation of the story, simple and gripping story. It's an appealing story, especially nowadays we uh, come to know that so many people fall in love, break up their relationship and so on. Thus, in this situation, uh, it suggests that the story uh, motivates us to face the realities of our life. Then, characterization through the, the character of Miss Meadows. The entire situation of the love babies, especially the people, uh, the heart of the uh, love failure people, it is reflected here. 
then the style is simple and then the writing is very easy to understand. These are the things that you need to pay attention in your class. Of course, now if you check your workbook, definitely you will find it. Uh, you will find the, uh, some question, model question answer as well as the summary, the theme. Everything is given there. Please, one time you read and try to understand the total thing, then you will be able to understand. All right. So please make sure of this one. I'll write down the notes and once you know uh, the story, dear students, you'll be able to uh, remember and then uh, write the answer which is needed because you will be asked to write an essay time. So so many points you need. You need to know the total thing. All right. So wait for my uh, this one. Now I think see we almost all the teachers take so many classes and unfortunately you people are not watching the video and trying to get the things because when we check we don't find any viewers there only one or two or three like that so you know my uh, personal YouTube channel everything is uploaded there what is my YouTube channel name Alan's Tutorials please check in this one. Uh, check in this one and find the video and learn it then definitely please you may ask other students of class 6 also 6 English first time second you will get from my same uh, uh, channel because Shri Ji means why my wife is uh, taking class for the students of class 6 English 1 and English 2 so please ask the junior students also to uh, subscribe the channel to visit it and learn it all right so soon i will be uploading most probably today or my tomorrow uh, latest i will be presenting the uh, broadcasting message to you all all right god bless you have a nice day thank you very much